<laughs> hey, y'all, come look at this. Welcome back to our channel. In this video, we are going to share with you about the recent Twitter hack that targeted many high-profile accounts and is also estimated to have made over one lakh dollars through Bitcoin scam. Watch till the end to know everything about the hack and the havoc that it has created. Without any further ado, let's get started. It all began with the tweets from many high-profile accounts like Elon Musk, Jeff Bezos, Bill Gates, Obama, and also companies like Apple and Uber, which tweeted a message saying that any Bitcoin amount sent to the provided address would be doubled and the offer lasts till 30 minutes. And guess what? It is estimated that within four hours, the promoted Bitcoin account, which was mentioned in the tweets by such high-profile accounts, might have received one lakh dollars in a series of 300 transactions. We have already seen so much in 2020, and in Twitter's case, this could be the worst hit. However, Twitter is doing its job to fix everything, starting with deleting such tweets and locking the popular verified accounts across its users. Recently, the official Twitter support account tweeted that they are still investigating the security incident. They also mentioned that tweets and password resets may also be affected as they are currently working on the fix. How did it happen? According to a few sources, this coordinated social engineering attack may have been possible due to the cyber criminals targeting the Twitter employees who have access to their internal systems and tools. The hackers somehow managed to get access to those tools which allowed them to target accounts with high influence and were successful in making such tweets. This could have been a disaster if the tweets were not about just money, because with so much power of social media in the wrong hands could do a lot worse politically and economically. Some of the victims of this hack indicated that they had two-factor authentication enabled and were using strong passwords, which typically makes unauthorized account access much more difficult. So, the typical password change and setting up of two-factor authentication may not be a solution for us users to stay secure in this case. It's clear that the vulnerability is at the Twitter's end and not at the user's end. The Twitter team is doing its job and we as users should stay away from such scams whether they are hacked or not. We personally recommend that if it's too good to be true, it's better to stay away from it. What should we do? If the popular social media giant like Twitter could get into such trouble, imagine what could be the case of other companies and organizations. Moreover, most of us are working from home with our home Wi-Fi's and many other personal unsecured devices. And also, the cyber attacks are on the rise amid the continuous COVID lockdown. If you are an employee of any such company, it's your duty also to safeguard yourself which can help safeguard the company you work for. Do practice the best possible cybersecurity practices and tighten up the security whether it's your primary coding laptop or just your secondary basic phone. Share the best things that you follow to keep yourself safe with your friends, relatives and bosses so that they too can spread the circle of shield which can save many others in such attacks or maybe even before such things happen. We have seen worse in 2020 and this may not seem much. But it's our duty to stay safe online and at home as well. That's it for today guys. See you in the next one.